Hello everyone and welcome home. It's Halloween month, which means you should be decorating your islands. Here I have nine spooky ideas for you. Number one, Magic Well. I like to start this off by saying this is not my original idea. I hosted a build battle once and somebody used this in their build and we all thought it was so cool. It looks like magic is making these flowers float above the well. I also added a sparkler behind the flowers for a more magical effect. The trick is to place down four tiles of water underneath the well so the object floats. You can use the flowers in the vase for it to float higher above the well or use the ones without a vase for it to float lower. I personally prefer the first variant. You can actually use some different things too, like a jack-o'-lantern. Make sure to cover up the dirt edges. Number 2. Ghosts. This uses the same concept as the previous idea. The snow ponies look like ghost ponies, so you can hide them around and pretend they're ghosts. Adding water underneath them makes it look like they're moving. You have to place a plate first though, otherwise the snow pony will just stand there. I suggest adding these behind walls or behind some crates and boxes. Number 3. Hanging Skull. This is very simple yet effective. So straightforward. I've used a straw as it looks like it's tied around the neck and a long sparkler with the same pattern as the rest of the rope. You can add a few bones on the ground too. Number 4. A guillotine. If the previous design didn't do the trick, this one sure will. I've seen many designs of this, but this one is definitely my favorite. I may have taken it from a person in my Discord server. For this design, you'll need some long decorative tables, fence posts, a normal fence, saws, and a basket with a skull underneath to really capture the whole point of this machine. Some red food items work well too. Number 5. A live tombstone. If you are lucky enough to be buried, you might want to go up to the surface to see the pretty moon. Add a skull and some garlic as the hoof bones for it to look like the skeleton is coming up from the ground. Number 6. Fez. Oh my, who did this to my boy Fez? A tragedy. The knife works so well with the Fez layers that I'm not even surprised somebody wanted to do such a crime. Number 7. Scarecrow. Of course I had to include a scarecrow. There are so many scarecrow designs, but I really enjoy mine as he has his signature hat and scarf on. I use a sphere lamp and unlit sparklers as the body, a jack-o'-lantern as the head, and some of the tags as the hat and scarf. The longer tag makes the scarf look like it's being slightly blown to the side. Number 8. Autumn Trees I know we have autumn trees in Ponytown, but it really bugs me how the trees have a falling animation, yet they are always full of leaves. Infinite Leaf Glitch? You can make a custom half-naked tree by using the grapevines, fence posts, and a stump. It looks really great zoomed out. They are super unique and worth a few extra objects, plus they are way more realistic. Number 9. Black Cat I love the black cat that sits on the fence post on the main map. They are so cute and I love them. You can bring this little lad to your island now. Use a black candy, black tiny only candles, and a cherry stem as the tail and bam! The most friend of all time. Bonus! Jam! Add a bunch of red berries, tomato slices, and bell pepper slices around your island to achieve the same vibe as adding restaurant in Minecraft. Thank you so much for watching! Happy Halloween! Bye!